Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Wealth is Freedom Budget, and we're here for November week four cash stuff. And we're gonna get right into the video. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and sixteen. Sixteen. Um, One thousand six hundred. Happy Thanksgiving, guys. Plus fifty. Uh, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, so 200, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, plus 300, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, plus 300, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, plus 300. I got my denominations mostly from the ATM, so I have so many 20s. I did go to the bank, but before I went to the bank, I actually did the ATM and then I ended up going to the bank. So anyways, so my numbers are all off. 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50. And I tried to make some change from my envelopes before I started the video. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, and 30. So, I don't know, we'll work with what we have. One, two, three, four, four. Plus, I said five. Let me just, I said four, so five, because I hit five on the keyboard. These are so crispy. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Plus seven. These are so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Plus eight. So we are cash stuff in two thousand eight hundred and fifty dollars. Um so we're gonna get started on my bills binder and let's see. Okay, all right. I'm gonna just fold my cheat sheet over here so I can see better. All right, so you're gonna see why. So next month, I'm not gonna wait until the end of the month to put away the money for my daughter's tuition because I did that and it was just, I didn't like it. So we're putting a thousand dollars in. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 800, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 80, and two. So let's see what we have. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 20, 40, 60, 80, 900, 20, 40, 60, 80, a thousand dollars. She has a hundred and sixty five dollars in here. We're just gonna add this one thousand right here. So now we should have seven. I think there's a twenty. Second um, deposit, a thousand. So one thousand one hundred and sixty-five dollars. I'm just gonna start putting this in every week. Okay. Um, summer program is gonna get twenty-five dollars. Just saving up for next summer. 
this one I got $25. So I wanna I need some change. I wanna make sure. So one, two, three, and four. So it has 40. I need those tens. So I wanna take those 20. Just and then 20. And then five. So we're going to 20, 40, 65, and 70. Oh, no, huh? $295 should be in there, okay? So we just added 25. Let's see, so it's 11, 22, I think today is. And we are adding 25. So we have $295 plus 25. So we should have 320. Let's see if that is correct. We have 252% money that's in the bank, 270, 290, 310, 315, and 320. So $320. And just slowly saving up for the summer of 2024. Stockpile is going to get $24. There it is. So stockpile is getting 24. So that's going to be a 20. 20. So then you 20. I'm going to take 25 and then put back a 1. So 22. So we just, it was 11. I think it's 20. I'm saying the 22nd, but. Um, 24 so it is it had 28 in there plus 24 so now stockpile has $52 let's see if that is correct 20 45 51 and 52 this is my daughter's um, platform that she uses to buy stocks um, Month ahead is going to get 25. Oh, month ahead is the one at the front. I'm like, wait. So the month ahead envelope I'm working on is my daughter's tuition. Oh. That's going to get $25. I'm trying to save one um one full tuition payment in here. So it should have 150. So 100 to present money that's in the bank. 120, 140, 145, and 150. Not bad. Uh Audible is going to get $20. So Audible is going to get 20 bucks. Audible is 20. Oh, I'm going to condense this down a little bit. Let's take twenty dollars out from here for Audible. So ten, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. I just made a little bit more change. So Audible had ninety-eight dollars. So this is eleven and. So it should be 118. Let's see. Yep, 118. Let's see if this is correct. Like 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 10, 15, 16, 17, and 18. I haven't done my bill calendar for December yet. When I do it, I'm going to drop the amount that I'm putting in every month for Audible because. 
I think my payment is yeah, my payment is sixteen dollars every month. Um, and I have a hundred and eighteen in here, so I'm way beyond how many months. So I think my bill cal calendar for December, I'm gonna probably drop this down from twenty to maybe like five dollars. Uh, Bancroft slash Worcester Academy is gonna get a hundred dollars. Just gonna get a hundred dollars. Um, so we have one twenty. So put in a hundred, so we should have five hundred and fifteen in here. Let's see, we have two fifty, two percent money that's in the bank, three fifty, four fifty, five hundred and ten, five fifteen. This is future tuition for future school. Um, Navient. Navient is going to get $85. can make some change out of here. So Navian is going to get 85. I'm going to make some change. So actually no. So I'm pick up 100 and I'm going to put back 15. How about that? That will be the 85. I really gotta, yeah, for December, I'm just gonna drop how much I'm putting in for these. Because technically, not for all, but for most of these envelopes, if I went through them, so we have 600. This is crazy. How did I get here? So, my Navian payment is 240 something, I think it's 243 every month. Excuse me, guys. Two forty-three, and I have six hundred and twenty-two dollars in here. Why do I have so much money in here? One hundred, two hundred, three hundred, three fifty, four hundred, four fifty, five hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, six hundred, ten, fifteen, sixteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. This is crazy. $622 in here. And my payment is only $247. But I'm paying $245 because I think I round up by a dollar and some change. So when I do my bill calendar for November for December, I'm really gonna change these numbers. Piano 65. I had intentionally made them way more than what I needed because I wanted to have extra in the event that something happened and I just, you know, wish I couldn't like meet my payments. But now it's just getting ridiculous. My eyes, I don't think I'm hungry. I mean, hungry, oh, Jesus, 195. I don't think I am 50, 65. I mean, I know I'm tired, but I think it's more than that. I need to get get my eyes tested again. Um, they just feel blurry. So we should have $195 after we add that 65. 51, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 85, 95. I'm going to try to get me some... Um, let's see if I can get a couple of 20s. So 20, and that'll make no sense. Yeah, actually, you know what, let's do that. Let's do $40. I just don't know what to expect as we go down the road, so I'm just trying to get as much change as I can. 
So we have 195 um, in piano. Pass. I almost came out my eyes. Um, three to six months expense. It's a new envelope that I added to my bills binder. And I chose to put it in my bills binder because I know it will get stuff if it's on my bill calendar. And that is going to be getting $60. So, we're at 20, 40, 60. Might as well. Ugh, that 20 is so dirty. So, that's going to get 60 bucks. Three to six months. It's a new one. I'm putting my bills binder because, again, I know we'll get stuff. Um, Amazon Music is going to be getting 25. 25. The music and I forgot to add parent survival to November bill calendar so I'm gonna have to do that for December so $25 oh well, that's a lot of five 10 20 just made some change and now I need putting all the dirty 20s over there Twenty-five dollars. This is another one I need to decrease significantly how much I'm putting in. So twenty-five. So we should have a hundred and ten. Let's see. Twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, ninety, one hundred, five, one hundred and ten dollars. And I was on music. And then Charlotte Klein dance lessons is getting 40. If I can find it. Here it is. So Charlotte Klein is going to be getting $40. 20, 40. So that should be 105. Let's see if we have 105 in here. 20, 40, 60, 80, 95, 101, 2, 3, 4, and 5. That's another way to like slowly bill your month ahead. If you do a bill calendar and you, you know, just add like an extra dollar or two to each bill. So if you uh, my mom's envelope is going to get 105 Just add like a, a dollar or two. So if your bill is like, I don't know, $18, just put it as, oh, the bill is $20 or $19. Or $19. And then you're going to pay the actual bill. You're not going to pay the extra, but I got to fix this for my mom after. Once again, she owes me money. Um, not her fault, but I always spend more in her envelope than what I actually put in. Robin Hood is gonna get twenty. Um, I need to deposit this money and get me a couple stocks, but I really do need to. So we have eleven twenty-two. Closet 20. So we have 145. Let's see. 20, 40, 60, 80, 120, 30, 45. So 145. And I could get me a couple stocks with this. Let me deposit that. Huh? Car insurance is going to get. Um, $70. Did I see my car insurance? Oh, I did. Okay, I was about to say. $70. Mm. I'm going to put 100 in here. Mm, no, I need a change. Actually... Yeah, 
and put back already. Yep. All right. So. Today might be the 23rd, so we put 70. So we have 192 plus 70, so 262. Our insurance is 108 every month. So 262, 100, 150, 200, 20, 45, 55, 61, and 62. 262. So we have about two and a half payments in here. Um, Motique is gonna get 26. Guys, I paid my Regis bill. I am done, but I still have the envelope in here somehow. I am finally done with that bill. Last week I paid it. So Motique is gonna get how many? I said 26. So no tick is gonna get twenty six dollars. Twenty six, yeah. Twenty six dollars. So glad I'm done with that Regis. I think today's the twenty third, you know, the day before Thanksgiving. What date is that? I have no idea. Hey Alexa, what date is today? Oh, it's the 22nd. So I was right the first time. All right. So $89. We should have $89 in here. 20, 40, 65, 75, 85, 86, 87, 88, and 89. Mm, do I want to take a couple of these? Okay. Alrighty. Then Apple. Apple is going to get 25. Apple's going to get 25. We're going to get a 20 and the 5. What's my apple? Apple amount, I think, is 25. So it has 55 plus 25, so $80. Let's see if that is correct. 20, 40, 65, 75, and $80. $80. T-Mobile is going to get $75. T-Mobile is going to get $75. I added my toll, put my tolls envelope in there, guys, in the bills binder. I moved it from debt. So T-Mobile is going to get $75. to drop back so I'm gonna have to just do this so 20 40 60 75 for T-Mobile so T-Mobile has um, 204 plus 75. So now T-Mobile has $279. And that is about two and a half, um, two and a half payments, or a little less than two and a half. So we have 
50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79. When I have the right amount of energy and mindset, I am going to go through these envelopes and take out the additional, like, extra payment amount and put in my month ahead um, binder. And then last but not least, Sally Mae is going to get 60 bucks. That envelope I know is struggling. This envelope is struggling without a doubt. I know that. I know this envelope doesn't have a lot in there. So. Sixty. So it should have 120. Which is more than what I need. 50, 70, 90, 110, 115, and 120. My payments are around like 113. So we are good to go. So that's it for bills, guys. So yeah. Look at how chunky she is. It's crazy. I'm gonna have to go through and take out the extra money. Alright, so let's go to the one little I thought was one little but only service challenge that we're doing right now. Which is my income increase. And she's going to get $20. This challenge gets $20 every pay period. This is... Raise from work. And I'm saving up instead of spending. So we have $250 to present money that's in the bank. $20, $40. 60 what am i talking about yeah 20 40 60 80 1 so it's 350 355 and 360 so 360 dollars is money that could have been built into my budget but has not so i think i'm gonna say i'm tired because i don't know Let's go to sinking funds and in this binder only two envelopes are getting love today yeah look at me i started throwing in some um categories or envelopes for next year all right so the first you all can guess which one it is is my emergency fund and that's gonna get one one two three hundred today um normally i put 308 but today it's only gonna get 300 because yeah, the money was had to be stretched in a lot of places, but that's okay. So we have seven thousand eight hundred and fifty-six dollars, and then we're gonna add three hundred. <gasps> finally! Oh my God, we finally hit the eight, guys. The first number starts with eight, so we have eight thousand one hundred and fifty-six dollars, and I am just so excited. Eight thousand one hundred and sixty-six dollars. I mean, fifty-six dollars. So we have, so we need ten thousand minus eight hundred, eight thousand. Sorry, one hundred and fifty-six. So we need one thousand eight hundred and forty-four dollars in the next five weeks. <laughs> Lord, divided by five. Mm. We're gonna be in trouble. That's a lot of money to come up with. To come up with in five weeks, but we'll see. So we have 5,000 to present money that's in the bank, 6,000, 7,000, 7,500, 7,000, uh, Seven thousand five hundred, seven thousand seven fifty. I gotta use my calculator. Seven thousand seven hundred and fifty dollars plus one, two, three, four plus four oh six plus four oh six. So yes, eight thousand one hundred and fifty six. So you know what, guys? What we're gonna do is condensing time. So let's do this. I want to do 
All right, let's do this. Let's put back. I'm gonna grab another one thousand dollar. Bear with me. At the end of the day, we just need to have eight thousand one hundred fifty six. So, um, can't wait to use this ten thousand dollar placeholder. We should have one thousand dollar. Okay, good. All right, so we need eight thousand in prop notes. So we have five thousand, six thousand, seven thousand, eight thousand in prop notes. And let's put this in here. And then we need a hundred and fifty six in cash. So one hundred. Um, choo -choo -choo -choo. so what I'm gonna do, I'll make some change. Hold on. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, and 100. Okay. So 8,156. And I'll double check that in front of you guys. Which means that. We're taking 250 back to the bank. All right. So this is going back to the bank. 100, 220, 40, 50. So 250 is going to go to the bank to go into my high yield savings. And let's see if we have 8,156 here. So we have 5,000, 6,000, 7,000, 8,000, 120, 40, 55, 56. Yes. At the beginning of the year, we set out to save $10,000 for emergency fund. We're struggling at the end here, but that's okay. That's totally fine. We'll see where we are by the last week in December. So that envelope and the other envelope that's going to get love today is, you all know, it's going to be Christmas. So Christmas is going to get 150 so it's 100 20 40 and 50 okay so christmas has um 150 so christmas have so we have 1717 plus 150 so christmas has 1867 so we should have 1867 in Christmas. So let's put this where it needs to go. Alright. 1867. So we have 1,002% money that's in the bank. I already took out this 1,000, I already started spending it. But I want to keep everything in here until the tracker says 2,000. If not, I'm going to confuse myself. So 1,000, 500, 600, 700, 750, 770, 790, 810, 830, 850, 860, 865, 66, and 67. So perfect. 1,867. We're going to put... We're going to send 250 to the bank and we're going to put in a 250 prop note in here. Okay. Get my money into the bank so that I can, um, you know, 20, 40, 60, 80. Okay. Um, let me see, minus 2,000. Okay. All right. So we're going to get a 250 into the bank. So that's it. So we only have $133, which is what I'm going to stuff next week. That 133 is going to get to my goal for Christmas, which is perfect. All right. So this is Christmas. I don't want to get them mixed up. And that is emergency fund. And that's it for my sinking funds binder. And um, let's see. Now... For the debt binder, because I have these binders available in my shop. Um, there's the soft 
faux leather. I have them in pink and brown. Um, so let's see. Let me get it, put up my calculator. So 36 plus 95. So PayPal is going to be $131. 131. If I can find it. 100. And the dingy money because it's going right back to the bank. 120. Um, 130 and 131. So PayPal is going to get 131. I lost some stuff using PayPal, so I'm just paying that back. Paying up my card. And then Capital One is going to get 50. And Chase is going to get 50. Capital One gets 50 and Chase gets 50. And let's see, now my checking buffer is going to get hmm. uh, wait, did I not calculate it properly? So it's Hold up, I think I, okay, so I'm going to have an extra $10, which is going to be nice. My chicken buffer is going to get 101, so 20, 40, 60, 80, let's do the dirty ones, 20, 40, 60, 80, 101 dollars for my chicken buffer. Um, when I did this, I didn't do the math properly, so I said the total was 110, but it's actually 101, so I'm going to have an extra $10, which is going to be awesome because my wallet, um, is not getting a lot of money this week, and it, I could use the extra in there, so that's actually nice, so I get to put that $10 let me see. I think I'm going to put that $10 in nails. Because I really need a pedicure. I'm just changing the numbers right here. Alright. So now, we're going to do my wallet. Per usual, I empty it and stuff my um, my variable spending envelope. So spending is going to get $20. And I have been spending like crazy this week, but it's budgeted money. Um, gas is going to get 50 I always have to go crazy and have more ones than what I actually need. That's fine. Gas is going to get 50 Grocery is going to get 80. Ew. I'm going to send that 10 back to the bank. I'll take this. All right. So grocery is going to get 80. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, and 80. Let's make sure that's correct. Grocery gets 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 65, 75, and 80 for grocery. Eat out is going to get a $10. So let's do a five and oof, so gross. One, two, three, four, and so e that gets ten dollars i'm not gonna recount that it's ten we're gonna trust that it's ten um household is gonna get five dollars let's do one two 
three, four, and five. The household is five. Miscellaneous is going to get three dollars. That's going to be one, two, and three. These ones are uh, so disgusting. It's not even funny. Miscellaneous is going to get three dollars. Self care is going to get twenty. Five, ten, fifteen, and twenty. And I am actually going to take this. I'm going to take this $20 here, put it in here for self care. Actually, you know what? No. Yeah, I'm going to take the fives. I need to change. Self care is going to, and then nails is going to get 10 if I did this correctly. There should be $10 left. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Yay. And nails get the 10 that's left. And I'm going to drop all this to the bank. And I'm going to take... Ugh. Um, lordy, lordy. Um, you know what? No, I'm going to take the ones. I'm going to... Because I need that. No. Mm. Look at this. No, let's take this. Okay, guys, that's it. So, thank you so much for staying tuned to the video. Um, I will see you next time for another cash stuff. And happy Thanksgiving, guys. Happy Turkey Day. Bye.